Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the Passbridge High School Music Department daily vlog. This is day one. This is the first time I've ever done a vlog. I have no idea what to call it. I don't really know what I'm doing. So please feel free to make some uh, how to improve your vlogsmith suggestions, um, sensible ones. And let me know if you can think of a snappy name for these. I really don't have a clue what I'm uh, supposed to be um, calling this. I can't think of anything that rhymes with Corona or sounds like Corona that is worth speaking about or recording about. So please uh, come up with something snappy and let me know what you think. So these are just a way of having a little bit of face to face ish contact in a time when we are supposed to be socially distancing ourselves from each other. Um, because just looking at words on a screen for the next few months is going to be uh, really disheartening, I think, for some people. So I will try and keep everybody as together as we can. Um, you are still part of the Parswood High School community. You are still part of the Parswood music family. That has not changed. If you look behind me, the office is still a bomb site, and on my desk is still some Diet Coke. So there's some things that will never change. And the fact that you are part of our community will never change. So we're just going to have to approach how we show that we're part of this community in a slightly different way. And um, given that we're not going to school as we normally would, we're not going to work as we normally would, we're not seeing each other as often as we normally would. So we're just going to have to make some changes. So in these vlogs every day, I'm going to try and give you a new musical keyword. I'm going to try and give you uh, some little tips that I'm finding quite helpful um, in terms of dealing with social distancing and isolation and give you some pieces of music to listen to because at the end of the day the internet hasn't stopped music is still out there listen to it stimulate yourselves you learn something new listen to something new so today's word start of the alphabet day one letter one is andante anybody know what andante means gcse and a-level kids you definitely definitely should know what this means from Italian, it literally translates as at a walking pace. And that is a really important thing that I'm finding um, now we're sort of supposed to be going out less and distancing ourselves from each other. Move, just move. If we sit down and just stare at a screen and don't get a heart rate going, don't do any exercise, if we just sit down for the next few months, it's going to have a huge impact on our mental and physical well-being. So please, 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 if you can, go out in the garden, walk the dog at a safe distance from other people, um, do some exercise videos online, just keep moving because you can't sit there and become a couch potato. Um, what I would like you to do in response to Andante is uh, send me some pieces of music that you know of or something new that you've listened to for the first time um, that is written at an Andante tempo. Play me a piece at an Andante tempo. Sing me a song, I don't mind. Just remind everybody that we are out there we're still here. We're just getting used to a slightly different routine. Um, today's piece of music. I walked into work this morning um, to get some fresh air because it was dead quiet. It was about half past six when I left the house and it was so nice to get some fresh air and uh, feel the sunshine, which was great. And this came on my Spotify as I was walking and it's called Pick Up The Pieces. And I thought, what better title for the first piece in this series of vlogs than Pick Up The Pieces? Because that's what we've got to do. It's a new situation. We're all getting used to it. None of us have ever done anything like this before. I had to live through anything like this before. Um, so pick up the pieces, people. We're just going to have to get used to do th doing things differently. Um, so keep listening um, to as much different music as you can. But if you need something that you've not heard before to start you off, this is the song. So use as much as you can from Dr. T. Smith. If we can't remember what Dr. T. Smith stands for, where do we go? The cheat sheet. Where's the cheat sheet? On Google Classroom. So see if you can do me a little bit of a Dr. T. Smith analysis, even if it's not all the elements, just some of them, of pick up the pieces. Let me know what instruments you can hear. Let me know if you liked it or not. There's no right or wrong answers as long as you can musically justify using keywords why you like or dislike this piece. That's all I want to know. So feel free. I'm going to try and post this video on Twitter. I'm not quite sure how to do that, um, but I will fathom it somehow. Um, and I will try and put our Twitter address somewhere obvious. Twitter handle, is that what it's called? I don't know. Um, so try and, as best as you can, get in contact with us. Let us know what you're listening to. Something that you've heard that you really like might spark something in somebody else. Um, and in the age of technology, we could be starting a whole Parswood playlist. Who knows? Um, so, Andante, pick up the pieces, move. 
stay safe and stay sensible. Um, hopefully, I will see you again tomorrow. Um, and yeah, fingers crossed I haven't screwed this up. I don't know. Um, but yeah, see you tomorrow and get listening. Get some fresh air in the garden if you can. And I will see you soon. Bye.